afternoon, folks. Big Bo with RVs with Big Bo at Parkway RV Center. Have I got a diesel Class A for y'all today? This is the big boy, big tag axle, four slides, diesel pusher. I'm talking about. This is why I love coming to work to see motorhomes like this. This is a 2008 Tiffin Phaeton model 42 qrh and this one just came in it is a tag axle 42 and a half feet long built on a spartan mountain chassis 81,000 miles i mean just absolutely uh a beautiful RV, guys, inside and out. It's a motor coach, not a motor home. And I know, guys, I get it. Not everybody can afford a $139,900 motor home. I can't afford one that expensive. But for those of you that can, it's a great deal for what it is. For those of you like me that can't, it's still pretty to look at. And you get a chance to see it up close and personal. So uh, four slides, all with awning toppers. It's got the HWH hydraulic leveling jacks, all hydraulic slides. Does have an 8.3 liter ISC Cummins diesel, 360 horsepower, um, 1,050 pound feet of torque with a 10,000 pound tow capacity. Beautiful full body paint. I mean, you look this thing around, guys. There's probably not a finer 08 out there on the market today. Um, does have all fiberglass roof this multi-stage full body paint this is a tiffin motorhome guys the build quality of a tiffin is legendary those that own tiffins that's usually all you own from now on once you once you have one aluminum alloy wheels shine um believe i i, I forgot to look the generator size up we'll call it a 10 kw if it's any different uh own and diesel if it's any different i'll put it in the video description below Check out this uh, hyper lift on the back. This is a power lift. I don't know what this costs, and it's all custom built into the coach. And it, it, it you don't leave it like that all the time, but this is like for a motorcycle, maybe a golf cart, a small golf cart, something like that. And you can still tow behind it. You got the extended hitch. A uh, thousand pounds, I believe, is what it's rated for. And uh, it'll actually fold up against the back when you're not using it. So you're not really greatly extending the length of your RV like you are right now. Got the tail lights on it and all that. So that's a nice little accessory. So I guess in a way that kind of makes it like a toy hauler. Of course, I got this great big commercial grade Cummins running right now. Air brakes, air bags, air suspension. Power awning. This thing has been meticulously maintained, guys. I mean, you can tell as soon as you walk in that somebody has taken extremely good care of this motorhome. For what these things cost new, I don't blame them. Um, you know, you look at a new 2022 Phaeton, you're looking half a million dollars. 10 gallon DSI water heater. Gas electric does have an outside television. I, I don't have the keys on me for these compartments, so I can't show it to you, but full pass-through chassis uh, storage. It is a raised rail chassis. Got the velvet chrome power heated mirrors, the triple camera backup system. Well, one on the back and then two side cameras. Of course, you've got your power door awning. This is a machine, guys. 139.9. You want to look up NADA? Go ahead. I'm ten, twelve thousand dollars less than what I should be selling it for. Especially if you add any options. It's got the stack washer and dryer. Uh, it's got the big nav, uh, built-in nav computer. Thing's got a huge screen on the dash. Um, 
I mean, and more. So this is definitely a heck of a rig, guys. Heck of a rig. Let's look inside. Now, we didn't put this carpet in, but this is not the factory carpet. They've done a good job. And not a lot of carpet in it because it's got some of the prettiest and it looks like a shiny marble floor i'm sure it's just a really high gloss ceramic but it looks like you're stepping into the taj mahal or something with <laughs> all that bling look at this beautiful motor coach guys all real leather sofas Leather captain's chairs, all flex steel, only the best. Look at that monitor. Ain't that crazy? <laughs> that is a huge backup camera. Mileage is 81,438 miles, not even broken in for this 8.3 ISC Cummins. And guys, this thing, dry, it'll run too. I mean, it'll run as fast as you want to take a 42 foot long plus vehicle down the road. And then some. Does have the Allison 3000 six speed automatic transmission. Uh, let's see, remote spotlight. More buttons in the space shuttle. HWH hydraulic leveling jacks. In my opinion, the most dependable one out there. Um, does have the engine brake. These seats are like sitting on recliners while you're driving. So I don't know if that's a good thing or not. As far as, uh, you know, being, sometimes I guess you can be too comfortable. You don't want to start nodding off. Uh, Sirius CD stereo, no check engine lights, no warning lights. I mean, and guys, now don't get me wrong. This thing's got a lot of equipment on it. I'll probably overlook some of it. So please don't judge me too bad about that. You know, motorhome like this got a lot of stuff, and I could easily shoot a two-hour long video on this thing, but I'm not going to. I mean, I just, for what it is, those of you looking at this, you already know what it is that can afford this and looking at something like this on the market. You've already done your research, so I shouldn't have to. I'm probably not telling you anything you don't already know. Um, power shades. see if I can squeeze over here somebody uh, left a seat pushed forward for the slide so can't really engine free heat you got the aired up map lights visors uh, radio switch air horn auxiliary start engine brake all that good stuff right here and what a machine, guys. Um, One-piece windshield, incredible visibility. That's what I love about a Class A. You sit up so tall, you really don't miss anything. And I know a lot of people don't like that, but I do. Even though I currently own a, a B plus or Class C, I, I prefer driving an A. It's just three to one over, over another one. And a diesel even more, because you got the motor in the back. Even with this big generator running up front, it's just so quiet. I hear the fan from the dash air more than I hear the actual uh, generator running. Do have the defrost fans, all solid wood cabinets. I mean, they just don't come any nicer than this, guys. Not for a used motor coach. And you know, like I said, the kind of person that owns this type of RV, they keep them undercover. They keep them serviced as a rule of thumb and keep everything maintained. And you've got two monster opposing slide outs with room to walk between them when they're in. You've got a table and chairs. You've got a leather sleeper sofa across from another one. So you can sleep six people in here. I mean, notice the attention to detail, the intricate woodworking around the facade, around the slide out. Etched glass front cabinets, television right here. Large, uh, for, and this is already getting cold. So it works, big refrigerator. 
this is the rv one so it does run off propane or electric it also has a 2000 watt inverter too so if you did not want to run your generator driving down the road for whatever reason um you don't have to and still power your fridge more you've got a month's worth of reading with all the books and manuals that's in this thing and i'm sure there's some i think i saw some service records in there too uh beautiful corian countertops no cracks which after eighty-one thousand miles tells you you've got a good riding chassis uh it's got a three zone ducted roof airs that blow ice cold um three a's three ac's up top microwave convection oven of course the decorations all that looks great notice the backsplash all the stove top covers and covers for your all the sinks and all that are here you know, none of them are broken none of them are missing like i said this has been an extremely well cared for coach when you buy a motorhome like this, you, that, that's more important than the price. Is how well it's been taken care of. Oh, Lord, it's cold back here. Um, <laughs> walk through, bathroom, big glass in shower, skylight. Even got you a soap shampoo dispenser. Fantastic vent fan. You do have a good solid door right here. Your water closet. Uh, you do have a China RV toilet. And with those three zones on high, it's really throwing out some AC in here, guys. I don't know if you can hear it or not. That is a ton of uh, airflow. <laughs> Fantastic vent fan. Uh, let's see, it's got fantastic vent fans for the entire coach. You do have the stack washer and dryer. I'm sure that wasn't cheap. Super washer and the dryer. But if you need one, you already got it. Huge rear bedroom with a King Island bed. Big closet across the back. And if you like it cold in your bedroom, you're going to love this coach. Look at all those dresser space and, and drawers and up here, some more storage. Looks like it's got all the original TVs in it, so everything fits perfectly. And you can change those out if you want to. I like the looks of a factory one myself. Of course, I don't watch a lot of TV when I'm camping, but, you know... If you do, there's nothing wrong with that. I mean, everybody's got their own version of RVing. Nobody's right, nobody's wrong. Um, central vacuum system. There's your hoses and stuff. Big deep closets. Headboard. That looks like, that might be the original bedspread. If not, it matches very good. Solid sliding doors for privacy. Oh yeah, I like it guys. You'll love the way a tag axle drives too. That extra axle, especially of course when you're in this long, you really need one. Um, better stability going down the road, better towing, uh, especially with that lift on the back. And you know, if you wanna take that lift off and sell it, that's up to you. That's probably worth a pretty penny, even if it's used. You know, you could probably sell that, and uh, I used to have that thing cost new, especially custom built like it is into it. This doesn't want, uh, you know, almost, if I didn't know better, I'd say it was almost something looks like Tiffin put on. And I may be wrong on that, but I wouldn't be surprised if that's a factory installed lift. But anyway, guys, this unit is $139,900. Uh, financing is available with approved credit and down payment, and um we do take trade-ins and we have nationwide delivery for a dollar fifty a loaded mile now guys normally with our rvs when we sell one it usually just includes the generator the refrigerator freezers the slide outs steps and roof airs only but this one guys we'll do we'll, we'll cover a lot more of the major stuff inspect it fix it if it needs it 
like uh, plumbing and propane and appliances and things like that i mean you know, I, obviously i can't i'm not going to go in and make this thing brand spanking new um because like i said new these things half a million dollars now so if you want a brand new one then buy a brand new 2022 for half a mil but you know for 139.9 i'll at least inspect the major stuff for you um you know if i see a switch not working or a, a cabinet and it's off track i mean that's just part of buying used guys you'll have to fix that yourself I, I haven't seen anything like that but i haven't looked at it that close um but i can tell you right now slide outs work generator works it, we drove it several hundred miles here got michelin tires and drivers kept talking about how good it drove um air conditioners are cold on the roof um so all that stuff's good all they really left to do is just check propane and check the uh uh check the water systems which i'm sure is fine i can't imagine somebody letting anything like as nice as this thing is i can't imagine anybody letting any kind of repair lapse and don't get me wrong any rv you buy there's always going to be these little mickey mouse things that drive you crazy and you get them all fixed and you find 20 more little mickey mouse things and that's stuff like switches and drawers and cabinets and just little things like that you know little that doesn't take just a few minutes to fix but you just got numerous one that's just part of owning an rv guys um anybody that thinks they're going to buy any used rv at any price and never have to work on it you're you're living a you're living in a dream world i hate to tell you even a brand new one's got tons of issues with it but at least they're under warranty for a year um after that they're they're same problems one like this would have but the thing is guys it's been well maintained um in fact there's a i've seen one service record in there from last year they spent forty three hundred dollars fixing stuff in it several things and um so i mean obviously they cared about this coach it really shows the way it looks 139.9 haggle free firm if you are interested in this motor home give us a call at 706-965-7929 if you want to come test drive it give us a call please keep in mind we only do test drives monday through friday so you have to make your plans accordingly um 139.9 will inspect the the like i said a little bit above and beyond our normal basic inspection you know we'll check the water the the plumbing and the propane and you know at least cover that stuff for you and of course you, you're welcome to come down anytime look at it inspect it yourself hire a third party inspection services if you want um i don't really think you're gonna find much wrong with it i really don't um only thing i found and is i've got one light and it's a fluorescent light and i think the starters and the light are back because you can't tell it on film but it'll barely turn on when you turn the switch on um so right there it tells me it probably just needs a new light or new starters and those and those things what 40 50 bucks at the most no big deal there i mean just little stuff like that just part of owning one but guys this is a nice unit i'm selling it for way under book if you're interested best speak up now and give us a call 706-965-7929 it's a tiffin allegro i mean this is a brand that's been around and has an excellent reputation y'all have heard me say it on plenty of videos especially in this area tiffin and new mars two brands you can't ever go wrong with well monaco and a couple others too but but that's your two main ones to me that really hold up and are really built very very well even in the later model ones than this they're built very well but they're not the cheapest either so you know just like anything else you buy what you pay for these things new you get what you pay for anyway guys thank you so much for watching i just wanted to put this one on i was really excited when they brought it around i love tiffins and i love tag axles so it's kind of a match made in heaven for me um you know being in this thing as long as i have i'll be honest with you guys i got the sudden urge to take a cross-country trip now <laughs> in an rv but uh oh well i just have to restrain that urge right now got a lot of neat rvs coming up guys some great class a's got some stuff uh, a lot lower priced ones coming up too so um if you hadn't hit that subscribe button hit that uh, subscribe 
smash me a thumbs up if you enjoyed the video feel free to comment share on social media feel free to if you're on facebook like my facebook page rvs with big bow you can message me on there i'm not in sales but i can give you advice about 25 years plus as an rv owner and working at rv dealerships doing every position you can think of guys i, I give you good advice save you some money hopefully um 139.9 plus applicable sales tax we charge no fees besides what the state makes us charge which if you are a georgia resident and georgia resident only we do have charged hundred dollar highway impact fee 40 to 50 dollar tag and title fee that's because the state makes us that's for georgia residents only out of state you just don't worry about that you don't have to pay it um we just keep things easy, simple, and done, haggle-free, firm. That's the price. doesn't matter how far you come or how you pay for it. Financing available with approved credit down payment. We offer nationwide delivery, $1.50 a mile one way. Take trade-ins. And um, if you're interested in any of this or interested in this coach or what else we may have, give us a call, 706-965-7929. Um, and one of my salespeople would be glad to help you out. Go to my website, parkwayrvcenter.com, see my current inventory of used RVs. These things come in every day and they leave every day, guys. So keep that in mind. Thank you so much for watching and look forward to seeing you here in beautiful Ringgold, Georgia.